Well, if you're here tonight at 7 o'clock instead of 10 o'clock, then you must be in our break for Leaf Greatest Hits Basketball. Yay. Can't wait. Can't wait. Been waiting to get in this one for a while. Um, yeah, this one's kind of a quick break in general. But as usual, we do have a little tiny bit of info that we'll kind of go over before we get started here. If I can find the right thing, we will anyway. Oh, that's the wrong thing. Well, that's okay. We can talk about this now, too. <laughs> I actually meant to talk about this last, but we can just talk about it now. Um, if you are interested in this, guys, it comes out tomorrow. It's a high-end basketball product, higher end than what we're about to open by about twice as much. And it, that is a case of 2017-18 Opulence Basketball. If you haven't seen the hits in it yet, they look spectacular. So, uh, of course, it comes out tomorrow. Haven't seen it live yet, but... We will work on this case as soon as we can get it sold, then we'll break it. Um, basically, if we could get it to fill up and get it sold by tomorrow, or on tomorrow or by tomorrow, Friday, I'll also throw in a box of 16, 17 grand reserve basketball and award those hits by way of random. But what we're doing with Opulence, this is a, um, a hits draft, okay? So basically what that means to you is that we open the case, we take out all of the cards, it's going to have 21 hits in the case. That'll be either autographs, relics, or autograph, relic combos. And then we'll also, somebody will have the option uh, of also taking all the base and parallel base cards, okay? So that means you've got 22 draft positions in the break. And it works like this, we open up the case, we take everything out, we look at all of our hits, use random.org to randomize the participants, and then, you know, we just go in order. So if you have draft position number one, you get your pick of anything that's come out of that case. You get the first choice. And if you had the fifth draft position, then, you know, obviously four cards would be gone. Anything that was left, you would have your choice of. So that's how it's going to work. It's $135 a spot. I know that sounds like a lot, guys, but this case is selling for $3,500 right now. I paid a little less than that because I pre-ordered it, so that's why our buy-in is a little bit less. Shipping costs are included. We're going to break it when we fill it. Uh, it says if you hit nothing, you get nothing, but everybody's going to hit something in this break. And it is, of course, like any break, no return, no refund. And I would really like to break it tomorrow, but I don't know if we're going to get all the positions sold. If you're interested in one, hit me up and let me know. On to tonight, what we're opening, random team break for our case of 2017-18 Leaf Greatest Hits Basketball. This is the first case of this we've broken. It came out, I don't know, four, five, six weeks ago, something like that. As a break bonus, I'm throwing in an autographed De'Aaron Fox jersey. We're going to award that to one team using random. Each one of our boxes in here is also going to have, in addition to our buyback cards, the Leaf Original card in this product is going to be autographed. According to Leaf, uh, that autograph will either be Le Leangelo Ball, LaMelo Ball, or Kyle Kuzma. So if we pull it out as Kuzma, of course, it'll go to the Lakers. If we pull out either one of the Ball brothers, we'll give that out by way of random as well. You guys are already bought in, so um, you know what you have going there. Uh, and actually, I guess I should have doubled that, shouldn't I? Yeah, I should have because we've got... 30 each but each person's got two teams to give us our 30 spots so it should have been just like that now we're doubled and in there properly so let's go ahead and fix that while while i'm at it let's just fix it well i made a mess didn't i see what happens when i do things on the fly i make a mess why is that not letting me go down i don't know my computer's being weird right now go down thank you Yeah, sorry guys, I just forgot to duplicate it down through there. My bad. But now it's all there. And everybody's uh, everybody has what they should have because it was two teams per spot, of course. So first up, let's go ahead and randomize our participant list. So I'm just copying this list and I will bring you along with me. Actually, I'll move you first so I don't forget and leave you somewhere. And here we go. 
Uh, with this many things in the list, I really don't see any need to randomize it more than one time. If you break with me often, you know if I have a small list, like 10 or less, I will usually randomize it three times. But when I have a large list of 11 or more, uh, I only randomize that sucker once. So here you can see everybody got copied and pasted and dropped in here. I'm going to hit random a single time, and this is going to be the first random that we do tonight. So this gives us, whoops, well, why won't my, hello mouse, what are you doing? Probably not the mouse, right? It's the user. <laughs> yeah, it's the end user. Okay, let's go back to our spreadsheet into our handy little blank space that I created. So this is now the new order after we did random. Is that the new order? That doesn't look like the new order. I don't think that copied out of, out of uh, the other thing, did it? I don't think that copied. Let me go back here and see, but I don't think it did. No, it didn't. I didn't think so. All right. We got to try again to copy this. Come on, man. Copy. Copy, copy, copy. Why is my computer not cooperating with us tonight? There we go. Now we're all about the business end of it. Let's get this where we can see it. There. That is our list randomized. So that is... Uh, our 30 participants in the new order that random.org just gave us. And what we're going to do now is randomize the teams and we'll just paste it across from that, which will match it all up and we'll be ready to open our case. If I can manage to maybe get it copied this time, right? <laughs> I don't know what this, maybe, you know, seven o'clock and I, maybe we don't get along. I need to be working at 10. Is that the deal? I don't know. Um, where are you? There you are. Okay, so there you can see all 30 of our teams have been copied and pasted in, randomizing those. And now, if I could grief, cooperate with me, please, mouse. I keep saying every day when it does this to me, I say, I've got to change the battery. And do I get the battery changed? I do not. And therein lies the problem, right? Maybe I can remember to do it after this break. I think that's why it's all sluggish and weird. Let's go back to our spreadsheet and drop these in next to make them big. And then you can see what everybody has and we'll be ready to, well, start opening things. Come on. What is the deal tonight? My mouse is definitely not my friend. Okay. That pasted on the wrong spreadsheet. Okay, clearly, yeah, the early evening is not agreeing with me, right? My mojo is just off, but that's all right. We're going to get it kicked back into gear before we open it. Now, at last, at last, we are, um, we are ready to go. Jay Allen, this is the Leaf Greatest Hits basketball that we're working on right now, uh, for sure. And the opulence basketball is the one, the high end one that I'm working on that comes out tomorrow. So that one is not full. Opulence is not. But of course, this greatest hits is. That's when we're getting ready to, to break right now. Now that I finally managed to get everything randomized and properly matched up. So Corey has the Jazz, Cutie Pie, the Wizards, Logic Boy, Rockets, Logic Boy, Hawks. Pope with the Mavericks, Corey with the Pacers, Corey with the Lakers, Corey with the Raptors, uh, Logic Boy with the Blazers, the Spurs, and the Grizzlies, Pope has the Bulls and the Pistons, Logic Boy has the Heat, Cutie Pie has the T-Wolves and the Suns, Logic Boy with the Magic, Cutie Pie has the Cavaliers, where did I leave off, hang on, yeah, Cutie Pie has the Cavaliers, Logic Boy with the Celtics, Cutie Pie Pelicans, Logic Boy Warriors, uh, Jeffrey Karma has the Bucks, oh, which is good because he likes the Bucks actually. Uh, Corey with the Clippers, Jeff Karma with the Kings, Cutie Pie Hornets, Corey with the Nets, Pope with the Nuggets, Pope with the Thunder, Logic Boy with the Knicks, and Pope with the 76ers. Okay, so that is how we're rolling tonight. That is our finalized list after randomizing both participants and teams. 
Now I simply need to take autofocus off and crack into this bad boy. Let's see what we've got in here. I hope it's something awesome. I think it will be. It usually is. Yeah, Jay Allen, I'm excited to get in here too. Leaf Greatest Hits is always so much fun. And even though we pull some really awesome stuff out of football and baseball, basketball is really my favorite in Greatest Hits for whatever reason. Leaf doesn't do a whole lot of basketball products, so usually they're what they do produce is really, really good. You know, they do a lot more football and even a lot more baseball than they do basketball. All right, so there's our two boxes that make up our case. Remember, at the end of this break, we will also be giving away that De'Aaron Fox jersey. So don't uh, wander off if you're part of this break. Don't wander off till that's done. Yeah, I agree with you, Jay Allen. It is always awesome stuff that comes out in basketball. I mean, it's always really good in football and baseball, too. But as I said, somehow basketball is my favorite with Leaf because they just have fewer releases. So they really tend to load them up and make them well worth our money, usually. Oh, boy, we got all kinds of things down in there. All right, so that is empty, empty. There's box number one out and about. Let's get box number two out and about. If I can manage to stop pulling out all the little foamies, that'd be good. Because that stuff leaves residue everywhere. So first off, our Leaf Original cards, uh, we have a Lamello ball. So as discussed, that one will give out by way of random. It's numbered to 60. So we'll just set it over here to remind me to do it with the De'Aaron Fox jersey in a minute. Our second one was Leangelo Ball, so no Kuzma tonight, but both the Ball brothers. And we'll give uh, each of those out using random. Now on to our hits. Oh, Lakers, right off the bat, there is Kobe Bryant on Dominion. That's quite nice. Is that going to be, that should be numbered. It's numbered to 49 on the Kobe Bryant out of Dominion. So nice hard signed Kobe autograph for the Lakers is a really good way to start things off. <laughs> Jay Allen, you said you've seen graded Michael Jordan rookies come out of here for sure. I mean, there's some crazy good stuff uh, that is possible. How about Dr. J on select um, for the 76ers? That also appears to be on card. That doesn't look like it's any kind of a, of a sticker auto either it is numbered to 99 and looks like yeah that came out of panini rewards look at that so somebody cashed in <laughs> rewards points and got that oh kobe's it kobe's a huge hit i mean anytime you hit kobe and it's a hard signed autograph i mean that's money that's you know a couple hundred bucks easily uh dr j is also of course a nice one. Oh man stupid lavar ball Mellow's my favorite. Okay, whatever. Like, I didn't even know he was an option in here. That just irritates me. That's numbered to 60, and we'll have to give that out by way of random, too. But believe it or not, as much as that irritates me, um, it is an extra card in that box, I think. Is it? Maybe it is. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, I guess it wasn't. It was one of the hits. Um, but it really will sell for some money, believe it or not, as much as that irritates me. That's a huge hit. Yeah, it is. That is an on-card Jason Tatum rookie autograph to 99 for the Celtics out of Absolute Basketball. So the Celtics with a very big hit and the Lakers with a very big hit and the 76ers with a nice hit too. Oh, well, let's just keep on rolling. Here's Donovan Mitchell. And, of course, that's going to the Jazz. That is on Panini Contenders Draft Picks. That one is a sticker auto, uh, but still, you know, it's a Donovan Mitchell rookie autograph. So, the Jazz with a nice hit there. We now have a 1995 Topps Finest Kevin Garnett graded Jim Mint 10. So, that's nothing to uh, sneeze at either. Really hard to get a Jim Mint 10 out of anything. And that Garnett rookie, that's that's uh, that's pretty okay, right? And Timberwolves, of course, if you can't see the team symbol, it's right down there on that lower part. 
How about Shaq, baby? <laughs> 1992 hoops, Shaquille O'Neal draft redemption for the magic. Wow, that's unexpected. That also grades a gem mint 10. So the magic pulling out a Shaq rookie. <laughs> Hey, I'll take that any day of the week, right? And finally, we have the Greek Freak with a Prism Rookie. And that is graded to 9.5. So that's, of course, out of 2013-14 Prism for the Greek Freak and the Bucks. So let's, uh, before we recap all this fun stuff, we have got, first of all, let me say I love the hits. We did very well, I think, with what we pulled. But secondly, we've got a bunch of things to randomize, the De'Aaron Fox jersey and all of this. But let's do this stuff first. So let's just do Leangelo first, okay? So let me, I'm going to put these in something so I can write on them and I know what team they go to so bear with me while I get uh, something I can put it in to accomplish that fact then I don't have to go back and watch this later and all that stuff so we'll just put them in these bags and then I can write on the bags so first up we're gonna do Leangelo ball we're just gonna give it out by way of random dot org and here's what we will do. I'm going to bring you back with me to our spreadsheet. Where did I put our teams originally? Here. Right? Yes, that's our original order of teams. Okay, so we've grabbed those. Now we're going to head back to random. Come on, random. And paste them in. And again, I'm going to hit random one time. Whoever ends up in the number one spot on this random will get Leangelo, Leangelo ball. All right, so here we go. Good luck. Comes out to the T-Wolves. So let me label that up. We know where it goes. And I'll switch you back to me briefly so we can look at the next thing that's going out by way of random. And that would be Lamello the lamello ball autograph and we're just basically going to do the exact same thing i should still have the list of teams on the clipboard one would hope we should just be able to paste them right back in here and rinse and repeat all right so there they are this is lamello good luck everyone it comes up to the knicks so the new york knicks get the valiant uh Lamello. Now we've got Lavar. We've got the whole ball family. Well, right, except for except for the one you probably wanted the most. <laughs> but that's okay. We got Donovan Mitchell and uh, Jason Tatum, so it's all good. All right. So here's our Lavar ball uh, leaf original card, which I'm telling you, believe it or not, people will pay for that. That will still bring some money. I know it seems crazy, but sad but true. And we're going again to the same scenario. LeVar is going to the Clippers. So let me get that one labeled up here. That's going to bring us to our De'Aaron Fox jersey. So back we go. Back we go to the homepage. Let me show you our jersey that's coming up and get all the Ball Brothers and things uh, out of the way and whatnot. All right, so there is the De'Aaron Fox autographed. It's a custom jersey, of course. It is a Beckett authenticated um, jersey. And there's your COA and your on product sticker. Jay Allen says LeVar played. Did he like play? In, I mean, he played in college or something, right? Uh, or high school or something. I don't believe LeVar Ball ever played in the NBA, did he? <laughs> Not that... Not that I'm aware of, did he? I don't think so. Um, so right now, this is the De'Aaron Fox jersey. We're going to head back over to random one more time. Handy little clipboard. Still has all of our teams on it. We're going to paste them in and run through this a final time. This one for the jersey. 
So good luck everyone on this. And it comes out to the Orlando Magic. The Orlando Magic get the De'Aaron Fox jersey. And you know what? Let's do, let's go put that in there so that, again, give me a, a little refresher here. Um, this is the jersey. We're just going to type it right in there so that I will know. Obviously, I can't write on that jersey now, can I? So this will serve as a reminder. Then we're going to do the recap here in a second. And let me get you back with me. Jay Allen is uh, thinking that LeVar Ball played in the NBA. I don't think LeVar Ball ever played a day in his life in the NBA, but but maybe. I mean, I'll go check it for you, but I don't think that he did. Um, I really don't think that he did, but maybe. But maybe. Um, as far as I know, he never played anywhere beyond, like, college, but... Uh, let me just see here. What does it say? Um, he played at like a prep college, then he went to Washington State, and then he went to Cal State, and that was it. So, yeah, collegiate basketball was the ceiling for LeVar Ball, which I was virtually certain was the case, but now I have verified it for sure. Yeah, I mean, because that's been the whole thing about LeVar, right? Like, people joke because it's you know he's always running his mouth but like he he only played in college and apparently wasn't even all that good from from what you hear anyway all right so this uh lavar ball autograph went to the clippers by way of random our lamello ball went to the knicks also by way of random the t wolves got leangelo ball you got it by way of random our De'Aaron Fox autographed jersey, Beckett Authenticated, ended up with the magic. Compliments of random. And our hits, Donovan Mitchell, rookie autograph, headed off to the Jazz. Of course, that is his, he's in his collegiate uniform, but obviously that's going to go to his current team, the Jazz. A nice Dr. J on-card autograph select card set for the 76ers. That is numbered to 99. There's a handsome Jason Tatum hard signed autograph on Absolute. Uh, that one is numbered to 99 as well. Nice rookie hit for the Celtics. The Kobe Bryant, that is a really nice hit for the Lakers out of Dominion, which of course was another high end product uh, from that came out this year. So that ought to have a decent resale value. It is numbered to 49. We have a rookie card of the Greek Freak out of 2013-14 Prism. It graded to a 9.5. It's headed to the Bucks. We have a 1992 Hoops Shaquille O'Neal Draft Redemption rookie card for the Magic. Graded out to 10. Gem Mint 10. And then we have Kevin Garnett. Gem Mint 10 uh, out of 1995. Top's Finest uh, rookie card there for the Timberwolves, and Kevin Garnett. So that is it for this case of Leaf Greatest Hits Basketball. Uh, one more time, I will put up the information about Opulence. If anyone's interested, I mean, it's a high-end product. As I said, its current pricing is $3,500 a case. I got it a little bit less than that because uh, I ordered it early. So that's why our pricing is a little bit less as well. It's a hits draft, guys, so everybody walks away with something. We open up the case, we look at everything, it'll have 21 hits in it, and then all of the base and parallel base will also go together as a group to basically be a 20-second option. And uh, we'll open it all up, we'll see what all of our hits are, we'll use random to randomize the participants, and then you'll just draft in order. So if you have the first pick, you would literally get to choose anything out of that case that we just opened you get to choose one card if you're the 10th position nine of the cards would be gone but you could pick from any of the cards that were left obviously the only person that doesn't have any choice at all would be whoever ended up in draft spot number 22 and then you would just get um you know whatever whatever happened to be remaining at that point but either way everybody is guaranteed to get something if we manage to get this break filled up and get it paid on or before tomorrow, Friday the 21st, which is its release day, 
I'll also add in a box of 16, 17 grand reserve basketball and we'll award those hits by way of random. Right now we have five of the 22 spots filled. I just opened this up last night. I'm hopeful that we can fill a few more of those tonight. If you're interested in it, please, please send me a message on eBay or hit me up in chat or something. Um, but otherwise, that has us wrapped up for Leaf Greatest Hits Basketball tonight, which of course was a direct break that we didn't sell on eBay. And then I'll be back at 10 o'clock this evening and we'll be working on the auctions that do end on eBay tonight. So I'll be back at it in a few hours. Hope you'll join me again then. In the meantime, I'm out for now. Thanks. We'll see you soon. Bye.